Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Welcome back to NASCAR Heat 5 for the playoffs for the Extreme Dirt Tour. We have four races left. I ended off last video, which was almost an hour long. I really apologize, but I wanted to do it, so I didn't. So I only did uh, two videos uh, before this one, and I wanted to do the entire playoff uh, playoffs in one single video. We have four races in the play in the first round of the playoffs. Uh, one race to try and have one playoff driver win their way into the final race, of the championship four con competition, uh, which will be held in Eldora. We start in Drebin. We then go to Jefferson Raceway, the road course, and then Fantech Fairgrounds, where I actually almost well I did flip over. Uh, while uh doing our uh uh warm up uh lap in our qualifying run at this circuit uh last episode uh which surprised me um and then we finish off the uh first round of playoff uh competition in Charlotte uh and then we'll move on to the final the finale in Eldora, where four drivers will compete for a championship. Let's head into Drebin. Here we go. Here we go, qualifying in the first round of the pl playoffs in Drebin, uh, where it always just feels like home. Uh, this was the first race that we ever competed in uh, in this career mode. looking to uh, do well once more. Here we got P5 in our first race. Here going to take pole position. And then earlier in the season we took pole position to go on and win. Mark Hunter, P4, the on our only teammate in the playoffs. Uh, Tony Stewart, P2, Bobby Carter, P3, Mark Hunter, P4, Cody Brock, P6, Leslie Gomez, P7, and uh, Caleb Stewart, P9. That is your playoff uh, drivers and their starting positions. Caleb Stevenson not getting off to a good start. We've been spun around by Tony Stewart. Not exactly too pleased with that. It's also, also it's actually also caused Mark Hunter a chance to uh, attack Tony Stewart as Mark Hunter now attacks Bobby Carter. As, oh, Caleb Stevenson has shoved Mark Hunter up the track. Now Leslie Gomez is able to get underneath uh, our teammate. Caleb Stevenson uh, is shown showing that he is aggressive. But Mark Hunter with a massive slide job to get back up into P2. We will win our way into the championship round. As Mark Hunter finishes, I believe that was P2. So yeah, we, Mark Hunter finishes P2 to set up a, a chance for him to go race for a championship. Uh, I'm a little upset with Tony, him tagging me and having us spin around. Uh, yeah, I'm uh, not pleased with that move, Tony, but uh, we can come out of Drebin knowing that we have advanced into the championship round. 
Okay, qualifying. Here at, uh, in my opinion, the hellhole of this uh, season. Jefferson. Hate this circuit. It's a fun circuit to race on. Don't get me wrong. It's on the dirt. <laughs> That's not exactly my guy. Uh, my uh, forte. This time, not hitting the barrier. Not yet. So we now start our lap. And there's the contact with the barrier. Not much, not as uh, bad as last time from last video, where we actually uh, smacked into the barrier and damaged the car. This time only just kissing it on the side, rubbing against it. It'll be a one lap shootout around this uh, circuit in the race. So one lap, uh, it's one lap speed I need. position we actually beat our uh, qualifying time from the uh, first race and Mark Hunter qualifies P3 I may actually sacrifice the uh, winning streak just to let him win the race because I want him to be in the playoffs Roy Wood is having a stellar weekend. Oh, great. He's going to be fast. Uh, Danny Hoffman starting from the back. He always starts at the back. And pole winner, Luke Martin, ourselves. Here we go. Um, okay, we'll see how the race goes. Uh, we got a one non-playoff driver in the top five. Uh, I don't think we're going to, oh my goodness, Tony Stewart with the dive bomb on Mark Hunter. Uh, okay. Let's see how Mark Hunter does. Uh, whoa, 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 okay. There goes the car. Car was sliding over the place. Uh, Mark now down to P5 uh, behind the non-playoff driver, so that's not exactly ideal. Uh, and now he falls out of the top five behind another non-playoff driver. Uh, yeah. Um, I was excited to see him qualify P3. Uh, but now I'm just scared for his finishing position because he's even behind Bobby Carter. This is not good for your playoff uh, chase, uh, Mark, uh, finishing P7. Not exactly good as he falls behind Tony Stewart. Tony uh, and Mark currently tied on points. Bobby Carter moves up into a very good position. Uh, 
well, not very good, uh, still uh, two points, only two points to the good uh, over Caleb Stevenson, but as it is right now, he is in the good. Uh, Roy Wood with the P2 moves up ahead of Cody Brock. Surprised to see that uh, 33 uh, in the playoffs. Uh, not surprised to see at rock bottom of the playoffs, but still. Uh, Roy Wood only five points back. So we now move on to the third race of the playoffs. Here we go. Phantom Tug Fairgrounds. Let's hope I don't flip the car this time. Into turn one. Thank you. You do make contact with the wall. Just a little couple of kisses. So we start our flying lap. sideways there. Set first time not on pole position. It's P2. Next to a driver who's not even in the playoffs. Huh. Okay. I'm a little concerned. But we immediately go up into the lead of the race. You got two non-playoff drivers up here. Huh. One of them is in a, a, a what is supposed to be a shit car. Mark up into P5. Nope. No, it's Bobby Carter. I never had a teammate in the uh, championship uh, competition uh, round before. And I'm trying to have it that he that we do have one but Mark is not really helping himself so we come through to take a 12th race win on the year Mark finishes P7 not exactly going to help your playoffs. Uh, now only five points to the good for Mark going into the final race of the uh, first uh, the uh, <coughs> round of eight semifinals. You got one more race in the semifinals. Two more races to go in the season. The final qualifying of the semifinals. Going for our 12th pole position on the year. Being beaten out by Lula, Cla Lula Cobb uh, in Fanatec Fairgrounds. I made a uh, mistake so uh, we ended up winning that race uh, obviously as we come through now for a 16.35 to take our 12th pole position on the year 
Mark Hunter, uh, P3, uh, having the uh, second best uh, playoff driver starting position, and what is even better is he is the ahead of Tony Stewart, Bobby Carter, uh, his two uh, top rivals. Uh, Leslie Gomez also looking for a place in the championship for competition starts P4. Here we go. Going green for the end of the uh, semifinal in the playoffs. Mark Hunter trying to keep hold of P3 ahead of Leslie Gomez. Leslie Gomez looking for a championship for a competition seat as uh, Justin Jones tries to overtake uh, Mark Hunter. He does overtake Mark Hunter. That's not what a, what we need from our teammate of Justin Jones. Not exactly ideal. Mark Hunter dropping back. And now he's still in the good as he gets overtaken by Leslie Gomez. Justin Jones may actually uh, lose out to Mark Hunter. He does Mark back up into the top five. Gomez up into P3. Can she manage a championship four spot? I don't think she's got it. Who are the four drivers who have been knocked out? And who are the other three drivers who will be joining myself in the Championship 4 competition? The Championship 4 is declared. Myself and Tony Stewart won two, respectively, in the points. And we do have Mark Hunter joining us in the championship four. And then rounding out the top four is Bobby Carter by one point over his teammate of Caleb Stevenson. It's off to Eldora for the finale. Final qualifying here in Eldora. Here we go. Who will have the advantage? Going into the final race of the season. Qualifying is very important. However, it's also the race that's important. Because it's whoever beats the other three to be the champion. So the goal uh, that the team has given me is to win the race. Which is pretty understandable. Having won every other race. So we take the final pole position. 13 pole positions on the season. And look at that. It's a uh, north field 1-2-3. And Mark Hunter, P2, are near... And then nearest rivals of Tony Stewart and Bobby Carter, P5 and 6. So, it's whoever beats the other three will be... The champion. Heading into the final race. 13 pole positions. 13 race wins. One race remains. It has been complete domination for Martin. He is most definitely a fan favorite for many in this championship. Starts on pole position. What can he do tonight? Here we go. Eldora. And Mark Hunter s starting at the back with an engine change. That is not what Mark wanted. And it's green, green, green. We got two non-playoff drivers 
uh, in between Tony and uh, Tony Stewart and Bobby Carter. One of them is a teammate. It's Bobby Carter and Tony Stewart get past Roy Wood. So we start the second lap. We just need to beat the other three. Mark Hunter, not going to be an issue. It's Tony Stewart and Bobby Carter we're worried about. Tony Stewart in P3 at the moment. Four seconds back. It's looking good as we come through to start lap. The final lap. Final lap here in Eldora. The finale. It's been pure domination central this season for us. It's fitting that we win the race to take the championship. We did it. We are the champions. With Northfield. And we celebrate in the typical fashion of dis damaging the car. During the burnouts. Oh, up on two wheels. PTSD. From... We did it. We are the champions. This is also the first time I've had a championship floor without the pink 20 of Leslie Gomez. So yeah. Uh, very unfortunate for her to be knocked out. Uh, but yeah. Just pure domination central for us in Northfield. Um... Unfortunate that Mark had to uh, start at the back. He ended up getting stuck in traffic. Wasn't able to get through uh, up uh, near the front, even with a new engine. Only managing to get up to P13. We did it. With our nearest rival finishing P3, we won the race to win the championship. And there's the championship trophy. Fastest lap, led every lap. Outstanding. Just outstanding. Nothing else to say. Just amazing. He did it. season comes to an end it's time to start planning for our second season which will be in the next video i hope to see you guys there don't forget to like subscribe hit that little bell get notified whenever i post new videos just like this one see you in the next one goodbye